السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته ازيكم عاملين ايه؟ فيلم النهارده ان شاء الله اللي هنتعلم معاه انجليزي هو فيلم ذا فاوندر الفيلم بيحكي عن السيرة الذاتية لراي كراك اول رئيس تنفيذ لسلسلة مطاعم ماكدونالدز العالمية وازاي قدر ياخد الفكرة من اصحابه الاصليين الاخوان ماكدونالد ويوصل بمطعم واحد بس لاكثر من 36 الف فرع حول العالم فيلم بطولة مايكل كيدن سو ناو ليتس ليرن انجلش ويز ذا فاوندر جريتلي انكريس يور ابيلتي تو برودوس ديليشيس Frosty milkshakes, fast. Mark my words. Dollars to donuts. 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 You greatly increase your ability to produce delicious frosty milkshakes fast. Mark my words. Dollars to donuts. Mark my words. دولاس تو دونتس في المقطع هنا بيشرح ازاي تعمل ميلك شيك طعمه حلو جدا وبشكل سريع بعد ما عرض فكرته حب ياكد على نجاح الفكره دي فقال مارك ما ووردز مارك ما ووردز سجل عليا كلامي ده مارك ما ووردز اف يو ساي مارك ما ووردز تو سم ون يو ار انفسايزنج ذات سمثينج يو هاف جاست سيد اور وورند ذيم اباوت از فيري لايكلي تو هابن كانك بتقول وبتاكد افتكروا كلامي ده كويس مارك ما ووردز مارك ما ووردز ان اللي انت بتقوله ده هيحصل هيحصل اكزامبل مارك ما ووردز nothing good will come of this افتكر كلامي كويس مفيش خير هيجي من الموضوع ده مارك ما ووردز مارك ما ووردز سكايلر تو ذا لاين or you will wind up just like hank you mark my words skyler you mark my words skyler you mark my words skyler dollars to donuts dollars to donuts sit to show that you are certain that something will happen sit to show that you are certain that something will happen examples it's a dollars to donuts that in the future banks will charge more for their services وأكد لك إن البنوك هتعلي قيمة خدماتها في المستقبل. I lost my umbrella. Dollars to donuts. It trains tomorrow. أنا ضيعت المظلة بتاعتي. وأكد لك إنها هتمطر بكرة. وهكذا. Dollars to donuts. Gateway drug. That's what we call it. In dollars to donuts, and I shit you not, that gateway drug was marijuana. In dollars to donuts, and I shit you not, that gateway drug was marijuana. Dollars to donuts and I shit you not. That gateway drug was marijuana. We may have underestimated the learning curve. So 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 we may have underestimated the learning curve. We may have underestimated the learning curve. Underestimate to fail to guess or understand the real cost, size, difficulty, etc. of something. انك ما تقدرش تقدر حجم او تكلفه او صعوبه شيء ما بتستخف بيه. في المثال اللي معانا في الفيلم هنا بيقول تقريبا كده احنا قللنا من شان الليرنينج كيرف او استخفينا بيه فده ادى لحدوث مشكله بعد كده. Learning curve is a process where people develop their skills or experience by learning from their mistakes. and to get the job done in a shorter time فترة تعلمك لشيء ما وتطبيقه من المفترض انها تقل مع مرور الوقت يعني لو بتعمل حاجة مثلا بعد شهر من تعلمها غير ما تعمل حاجة بعد سنة من تعلمها هتاخد وقت ومجهود وتكلفة اكيد اقل فهو ده ال learning curve Don't underestimate me Who are you? A dangerous man Don't underestimate me. Don't underestimate me. Don't underestimate me. Captured six scared civilians, killed three Jap soldiers, and lost 11 U.S. Marines. We failed. We underestimated, sir. Underestimated. We failed. We underestimated, sir. Underestimated. We failed. We underestimated, sir. Underestimated. I've been in here most of my life. I'm an institutional man now. It's like Brooks was. Wow, how do you underestimate yourself? Wow, how do you underestimate yourself? Wow, how do you underestimate yourself? Wow, how do you underestimate yourself?
underestimate yourself. It's being conservative. Mine, based on gut. And my gut tells me those numbers are low. McDonald's growing as quick as a hiccup. He's this. being conservative. Mine, based on gut. And my gut tells me those numbers are low. McDonald's growing as quick as a hiccup. He's this. being conservative. Mine, based on gut. And my gut tells me those numbers are low. McDonald's growing as quick as a hiccup. I'm being conservative. Mine, based on gut. And my gut tells me those numbers are low. McDonald's is growing quick as a hiccup. في المثال هنا بيقول إن شريكه conservative. وده معناه إنه شخص متحفظ. دايما توقعاته بتبقى أقل من الحقيقة. ولكن أنا بعتمد على my gut. And my gut tells me those numbers are low. My gut tells me. This means that you have an intuition that something is right or wrong. But you don't really have a solid evidence. But you don't really have a solid evidence. كأنك بتقول حاجة بديهية. حاجة جواك بتأكد لك إن موضوع ما صح أو غلط. بس في نفس الوقت ما عندكش دليل مادي على صحة كلامك ده. My gut tells me. We're businessmen that operate from our gut. And my gut tells me to give you this opportunity. We're businessmen that operate from our gut. And my gut tells me to give you this opportunity. Do you have proof? I got my gut. Do you have proof? I got my gut. Do you have proof? I got my gut. There's a wolf in the hen house. We let him in. I never should have listened. We have a contract for just this sort of thing, Dick. Should have trusted my gut. 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 The time I thought I was trusting my instincts, you know? I was trusting my gut. Calm down. My just heart. Calm down. The time I thought I was trusting my instincts, you know? I was trusting my gut. Calm down. My just heart. Calm down. I guarantee you, if you've got the guts, you got the gumption, you got the desire, I guarantee you, you can succeed. I guarantee you, if you've got the guts, you got the gumption, you got the desire, I guarantee you, you can succeed. I guarantee you, if you've got the guts, you got the gumption, you got the desire. I guarantee you, you can succeed. I guarantee you, if you have the guts, got the gumption, you have got the desire, I guarantee you, you can succeed. If you have the guts to do something, that means you are brave. You have enough courage, conviction, or resolve to do something. يعني لو قلت I have the guts معناها إنك بتقول أنا عندي الشجاعة والعزم إن نعمل الحاجة دي. I have the guts. Right woman comes along, you will have the courage and the guts to say, no thanks, I'm married. Right woman comes along, you will have the courage and the guts to say, no thanks, I'm married. If you don't have the guts to attend Jordan Belfort's straight line persuasion system seminar, then how do you expect to make any money? If you want to be a millionaire someday, have some guts, make a decision. If you don't have the guts to attend Jordan Belfort's straight line persuasion system seminar, then how do you expect to make any money? If you want to be a millionaire someday, have some guts, make a decision. Mr. Kroc, if you're not making money hand over fist, something's terribly wrong. Mr. Kroc, if you're not making money hand over fist, something's terribly wrong. Mr. Kroc, if you're not making money hand over fist, something's terribly wrong. Mr. Kroc, if you're not making money hand over fist, something's terribly wrong. Mr. Kroc, if you are not making money hand over fist, something is terribly wrong. If you are not making money hand over fist, something is terribly wrong. Making money hand over fist. If you make or lose money hand over fist, you make or lose a lot of money very quickly. Example, business was good and we were making money hand over fist. Business was good and we were making money hand over fist. الشغل كان ماشي كويس جدا وكنا بنعمل فلوس كتير وبسرعه فلو عايز توصف حاجه بانها بتحصل بشكل سريع او كبير ممكن تستخدم الاكسبريشن ده hand over fist selling garbage to garbage men and making cash hand over fist I was selling garbage to garbage men and making cash hand over fist hey, but at the end of two weeks I get $700 wow you're going to be making money hand over fist <laughs> Hey, but at the end of two weeks, I get $700. Hey. Wow, Ooh, you're going to be making money hand over fist. It's triple R cut. Well, you should be getting more too then, shouldn't you? We are not greedy men. Greed has nothing to do with it. If I... It's almost triple R cut. Well, you should be getting more too then, shouldn't you? We are not greedy men. Greed has nothing to do with it. If... It's almost triple R cut. Well, you should be getting more too then, shouldn't you? We are not greedy men. Greed has nothing to do with it. If... It's almost triple R cut. You should be getting more too then, shouldn't you? We are not greedy men. Greed has nothing to do with it. 
جريد هاز نوثينج تو دو ويز ات المقطع هنا بيقول ان حصتك او نصيبك تقريبا قدنا ثلاث مرات اتس اولموست تريبل اور كات فقال له تمام يبقى انت المفروض تحصل اكتر من كده فرد وقال له وي ار نوت جريدي مان وي ار نوت جريدي مان يعني احنا مش طماعين فقال له جريد هاز نوثينج تو دو ويز ات جريد هاز نوثينج تو دو ويز ات الطمع ملوش علاقه فلو عايز تنفي علاقتك بشخص او بشيء ما بتقول I have nothing to do with it I have nothing to do with it Looking at a letterhead with the name McDonald's on it You care to explain? It was confusing People didn't even know it had anything to do with McDonald's Some of you might be wondering and too polite to ask I had nothing to do with the disappearance of my wife I had nothing to do with the disappearance of my wife I had nothing to do with the disappearance of my wife. Hazel, I know Gus is sick, but you gotta take care of Mom, yourself. Mom, this, this has nothing to do with Gus. Well, then you've gotta stay healthy. Don't even think something like that. Mom left because of Mom, and you didn't have anything to do with that, okay? Mom left because of Mom, and you didn't have anything to do with that, okay? Mom left because of Mom, and you didn't have anything to do with that, okay? I'll tell you, you've got a hell of a restaurant here. Well, coming from you, that's quite a compliment. My reputation precedes me. <laughs> oh boy, I'll tell you, you got a hell of a restaurant here. Well, coming from you, that's quite a compliment. My reputation precedes me. <laughs> oh boy, I'll tell you, you got a hell of a restaurant here. Well, coming from you, that's quite a compliment. My reputation precedes me. <laughs> oh boy, I'll tell you, you got a hell of a restaurant here. Well, coming from you, that's quite a compliment. My reputation precedes me. <laughs> I tell you, you got one hell of a restaurant here. Well, coming from you, that's quite a compliment. My reputation precedes me. Hell of a. You say hell of a. To emphasize that something is very good, very bad, or very big. فهو بيقول له أنت بتمتلك مطعم رائع جدا. رد عليه وقال له Well, coming from you, that's quite a compliment. و compliment معناها إنك تثني على حد أو تمدح فيه. Compliment. My reputation precedes me. If your reputation precedes you, it means people have heard things about you before they actually meet you. These things could be positive or negative. They could be also true or false. Sometimes people's reputation are built upon gossips and rumors. فبمنتهى البساطة, if your reputation precedes you, معناها إن الناس بتكون سمعة عنك حاجات حتى قبل ما تقابلك أو تعرفك. الحاجات دي ممكن تكون إيجابية أو سلبية. ممكن تكون صح أو غلط. كتير جدا من الناس بيبني آراءه عن الآخرين عن طريق الإشاعات والقيل والقال. بالعامية كده لو قلت لحد your reputation precedes you كأنك بتقول له سمعتك سبقاك أنا مش متفاجئ من اللي انت بتعمله ده خلينا ناخد موقف بين ثلاث أشخاص فيهم صديق مشترك عايز يعرفهم على بعض الحوار اللي هيدور ما بينهم هيعرفنا كويس ازاي وامتى نقدر نستخدم الاكسبريشن بتاع your reputation precedes you كيت this is my best friend Patrick hi Patrick it's nice to finally meet you It's nice to meet you too. I'm sorry we are late. We were driving here and we saw a little old lady whose car had broken down. We stopped to help. That doesn't surprise me. Ethan already told me all about how kind and helpful you are. Your reputation precedes you. Look, fellas, you'll get your full royalties, all right? Got my word on that. 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 Look, fellas, you'll get your full royalties, all right? You've got my word on that. You have got my word on that. كأنه بيقول لهم I promise. أوعدكم بكده. دي كلمة شرف مني. إنكم هتحصلوا على عائداتكم من الشركة بالكامل. You have my word. You have my word. You will get your full royalties. Royalty is a payment that one party pays to another. In exchange for the use of their intellectual property. ده العائد اللي بتحصل عليه مقابل استخدام حاجة بتملكها بواسطة طرف آخر. Royalty. Royalty. I am aware that we're behind, sir, but you have my word we're good for it this month. Yes, I did. I I did see the notice, but like I said, you have my word. Every restaurant in the Midwest has a basement and a furnace. This is standard stuff. I understand, but it's our name on that building. 
God forbid the floor caves in and people get hurt or worse because of some design flaw we missed. God forbid the floor caves in and people get hurt or worse. God forbid the floor caves in and people get hurt or worse. Every restaurant in the Midwest has a basement and a furnace. This is a standard staff. I understand, but it's our name on that building. God forbid the floor caves in and people get hurt or worse because of some design flaw we missed. كل المطاعم عندها قبو بيسمنت وفرن فيرنس دي حاجات أساسية فقال له تمام بس اسمنا على المبنى ده It's our name on that building God forbid the floor caves in and people get hurt or worse لقدر الله أو لسمح الله المبنى يحصل له أي حاجة والناس تتأذى بسبب عيب في التصميم Design flaw Design flaw God forbid If you say God forbid you are expressing you hope that something will not happen. Also used sarcastically to express the opposite. فلو قلت God forbid معناها انك بتتمنى عدم حدوث شيء ما وكمان ممكن تستخدمها بشكل تهكمي على شيء بتقصد عكسه. Example God forbid you clean up after yourself. God forbid you clean up after yourself. حد مش بينظف مكانه أبدا فأنت عايز تتريق عليه فبتقول له لا سمح الله يعني إنك تنظف مرة واحدة بس مكانك God forbid you clean after yourself Why can't we treat death with a certain amount of humanity and dignity and decency and God forbid maybe even humor Death is not the enemy gentlemen and God forbid maybe even humor and God forbid maybe even humor and God forbid maybe even humor This baby can't feel a thing because everything's fake God forbid we have real emotion in this show this baby can't feel a thing because everything's fake. God forbid we have real emotion in this show. I don't want to overstep my bounds here, but I may have found a solution. I don't want to overstep my bounds here, but I may have found a solution. I don't want to overstep my bounds here, but I may have found a solution. I don't want to overstep my bounds here, but I may have found a solution. I don't want to overstep my bounds here, but we may have found a solution. Overstep the bounds. To do something that is not acceptable or allowed. إنك تعمل أو تقول حاجة فيها نوع من التعدي على الآخرين. فبكده you overstepped. You overstepped. إنك تعديت حدودك. Jules, I apologize if I overstepped in some no. way. No, no. Jules, I apologize if I overstepped in some no. way. No, no. Jules, I apologize if I overstepped in some no. way. No, no. Jules, I apologize if I overstepped in some no. way. No. I feel like I overstepped before. Um, you know I love you. You know I love you guys. I feel like I overstepped before. I feel like I overstepped before. You know the perfect person to own and operate. You don't say. I know the perfect person to own and operate. You don't say. I know the perfect person to own and operate. You don't say. I know the perfect person to own and operate. You don't say. I know the perfect person to own and operate. You don't say. You don't say. You don't say. Used to express surprise. Example, he's just won the lottery. You don't say. You don't say. هو كسب اللي أنا صيب. كأنك بتقول إيه ده بجد كسب ما تقولش. You don't say. You don't say. Also, you don't say used to express sarcasm when someone states the obvious or states a fact. كمان you don't say بتستخدم للسخرية لما حد يقول معلومة واضحة جدا ومعروفة. زي مقطع هنشوفه دلوقتي واحد بيسوق بشكل متهور جدا. فالبنت راكبة معاه وخايفة. فبيقول لها أنا سقطت في اختبار السواقة مرتين، فقالت له You don't say, you don't say، كأنها بتتريق عليه، عايزة تقول له من غير ما تقول، باين من اللي أنت بتعمله. I failed my test a couple times. You don't say. Yeah, I failed my test a couple times. You don't say. I failed my test a couple times. You don't say. I may have found a solution. Which you owned it, actually. You don't say. Right to call me at my home? That's a blatant invasion of my With all due respect, you have no right to call me at my home. That's a blatant invasion of my With all due respect, you have no right to call me at my home. That's a blatant invasion of my privacy. You have no right to call me at home. It's a blatant invasion of my privacy. It's a blatant invasion of my privacy. Invasion of my privacy. If someone or something invades your privacy, they interfere in your life without your permission. 
ناس بتحاول تتدخل في حياتك تعرف عنك اسرار او معلومات المفروض ما حدش يعرفها غيرك فبكده بيكونوا invade your privacy invade your privacy وفي المثال هنا هو كان قايل لهم ما حدش يتصل عندي في البيت لو عايزيني في اي حاجه كلموني في المكتب هو عايز يخفي عن مراته ان هو رهن البيت فلما اتاخر عن سداد القسط كلموه في البيت فراح متعصب جدا وقال لهم اتس ا بليتنت انفيجن اوف ماي برايفسي ده تعدي صارخ ووقح جدا على خصوصيتي انفيجن اوف ماي برايفسي It's intrusive. We want you out of this company, Ray. Mac, how do you propose you do that? We will sue you whatever it takes. 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 We want you out of this company, Ray. Mac, how do you propose to do that? We will sue you whatever it takes. We will sue you. Sue is a verb. If you sue someone, you start a legal case against them. Usually, in order to claim money from them because they have harmed you in some way. تقاضي حد وترفع عليه قضية وتطلب بتعويض مادي بسبب أي أضاء الحقد بيك بتستخدم الفيرب ده sue. I will sue you. I will sue you. هقضي كرفع عليك قضية في المحكمة. And I'm gonna sue you for every cent. And I'm gonna sue you for every cent. And I'm gonna sue you for every cent. This is Harvard, where you don't plant stories and you don't sue people. This is Harvard, where you don't plant stories and you don't sue people. This is Harvard, where you don't plant stories and you don't sue people. This is Harvard, where you don't plant stories and you don't sue people. I'm looking for a few good men and women who aren't afraid of hard work, aren't afraid to roll up their sleeves. Cliche, I know, but I'm looking for scrappers, hustlers, guys who are willing to roll up their sleeves. Guys who are willing to roll up their sleeves. Guys who are willing to roll up their sleeves. Guys who are willing to roll up their sleeves. Roll up your sleeves. To do or get ready to do something difficult, intense, or demanding. Literally, rolling up one's sleeves is often done before performing hard work. Roll up your sleeves. إنك تحضر وتهيئ نفسك لعمل حاجة صعبة ومجهدة حاجة هتتطلب منك مجهود وطاقة Roll up your sleeves Examples We have a long day ahead So let's roll up our sleeves and start We have a long day ahead So let's roll up our sleeves and start عندنا يوم طويل النهاردة وشغل كتير يلا بينا نستعد بكل قوة ونبدأ Let's roll up our sleeves It's time to roll up our sleeves and to get the job done It's time to roll up our sleeves and to get the job done. ده الوقت اللي نشمر فيه عن سواعدنا ونستعد بكل قوة وننفذ الشغل. It's time to roll up our sleeves and to get the job done. Have organizational skills, a genuine interest in e-commerce, whatever that is, and a roll up your sleeves attitude. 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 وبكده نكون خلصنا كل الجمل والكلمات اللي كانت معانا النهاردة هتلاقيها كلها تحت في الديسكريبشن هتمنى نكون استفدنا منها حاجة ونشوفكم الأسبوع الجاي إن شاء الله مع فيلم جديد ولنا إنجليش with American Movies سلام عليكم